If you've been sent the latest Speedplay APK file via email, uh, this video will show you how you can actually install it. There are two ways you can go about it. So we email you a Dropbox link. You can either download it on your computer uh, and then pop the file onto an SD card. Now just remember, it's an APK file, which is an Android installer package. You're not gonna be able to open it up on your computer, nor do you have to. All you need to do is just download the link, download the file, it will then be in your downloads folder, and then you just drag it onto an SD card or a USB. But in this video, I'm gonna show you if you don't have access to a computer, how you can actually do it on the head unit itself. So what I've done on the head unit, I've actually installed uh, a Gmail app. So I'm just gonna go into Gmail. So obviously you will need internet connectivity um, to be able to access emails and things like that. Um, so this is the email from us, um, Polaris Sales, Speedplane US APK. I'm going to click on that. Um, as you'll see, there's a link. So it's a Dropbox link. And then there's instructions. So you can either follow the instructions written or you can watch this video. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to click the link. Okay, so uh, we don't want the app, we just want to continue to the website. Um, and then we scroll down until we find a little download symbol. So it's going to download it onto the head unit. Okay, so we've got it, it's downloaded. Open? No, we don't want to open it. We don't need to open it. We just need to find the file and extract it um, as it will be zipped coming from Dropbox. So what we're going to do is we are going to find an app called Files. So it should look like this. And we're going to click into it. Okay, and then we're going to find our Downloads folder. Okay, so it should look something like this. So you can see that's the little zipped symbol. Uh, so we're going to select it. Now it'll take it to another page. Now what we're going to do is we are going to... So if you touch on the screen, it actually won't select it. So you want to go up here to your three little dots. And you want to go select all. And then again, same three dots, you want to go extract to. Okay, so it's going to extract into your downloads folder. So we're going to go extract. And now if we go back into the downloads folder, we will have the actual APK. Okay, so this one here is the APK file. This one is the zipped folder. This one you won't be able to do anything with. You, you have to extract it first. So this is the one. Um, so now what we're going to do is we're going to click Home. We're going to get out of Files. And we're going to go to File Browser. Flash is the local. Uh, GPS is a GPS card that I have uh, also in the head unit. We want Flash. We want Downloads. See this little Android symbol in a box? That's your APK. So we're just going to click on it. Um, okay, so we're going to allow permissions. So install unknown apps. Yes, and then hit return. Install. open it up okay so you can see now we have the latest speedplay APK if you're upgrading uh, from a lower version you don't have to delete the speedplay app first 
Uh, if for some reason we have to downgrade you, you will have to delete Speedplay first and then install the APK file. Um, and then the other way to do it, obviously, is you could just download the APK file on your computer um, and then you can go into File Browser again or APK Installer, it doesn't really matter. Um, once you've downloaded it on the computer, again, extract it, pop it onto an SD card or a USB, and you can go APK Installer, you can go GPS, which is my GPS card, and right down the bottom, I've got it here. So again, just showing you how it installs. Um, we're just installing the same Speedplay app over and over again, so it's not going to do any any damage. Uh, open. And yes. And that's it. Easy.